Fringe Festival is an event that has taken place in Philadelphia for the past six years. And Diana actually interned at the Fringe Festival this summer, so she can give you an idea of what it is and what is involved in making it happen. Uh, that's right. I, that's right. I interned with the Philadelphia Fringe Festival all summer, and Fringe is kind of a hard concept to put a, a exact definition on, but kind of a catch-all definition for you is that it's a avant-garde performance festival. If you want to call it avant-garde, that incorporates dance, theater, physical theater, poetry, puppetry, buskers, which are street performances, um, and anything and everything in between. But most importantly, Fringe is non-mainstream performance art. Um, and I'm very excited that the Fringe is here this year. Dominic brings the Fringe to our sinus every year. It's an incredible opportunity for this campus. I think we're the only school that I know of that does anything like this. This is the third year it's been at our sinus. And um, the audiences have grown over the years. And, and the performers are happy to come out here and perform for the students here. Um, it's, it is a great opportunity. It is the only location that I know of that immediately following the Philadelphia Fringe Festival, there's a host of events in one area. And um, we're really not just a school, but really anywhere that is doing this after the Philadelphia Fringe Festival closes. My first involvement with the film festival, uh, Fringe Festival, was acting. And last year I directed a piece, which we did ha out here at our Sinus College. Dominic had us out here to do Breach of Contract, which was kind of a campy film noir spoof. And this year I submitted my idea for Jersey Boy to the Fringe Festival. Hey, my name is Josh, Josh Berkerson. Chris saw me in last year's Fringe Festival play a very dark, mysterious, brooding character, an FBI agent who was convincing Lee Harvey Oswald to do the deal. Um, and he saw me basically with a haircut like this, wearing practically this exact same costume. And that's what, when he saw that, he knew that I'd be good for the three different characters that I played. Um, I usually do comedy. I'm, I'm much more known for my 
off the wall, wacky, you know, comic roles. And uh, this year, I got to really show my dramatic side that I can go out there and I can play, you know, Amina Sobi. 